Then I saw us. I'm going to be talking about something different because I don't see this topic talked about that much. And I decided I'd like to give my thoughts on it. Speaking of which, or anyways, I'd like to thank the six people who had subscribed. Never in my life had I gotten six people to subscribe to my channel. It, this is really a miracle, fellas. Anyways, with that all aside, let, what we're talking about today is whether AI voice cloning is better than typical voice impression. To clear up the smoke, AI voice cloning is when artificial intelligence is used to imitate another person's voice, while voice impressions is just people changing their tone and voice mannerisms to imitate another person's voice or another character's voice. Recently, there have been a large amount of videos using AI voice cloning making characters talk, sing, and play Fortnite. The voice cloning can be very realistic. It can trick people into thinking that they are legit sometimes. But before we get into that, let's talk about how voice cloning works in the first place. Most voice cloning online comes from a website called the Lemon Lab, and I'll be basing my info off that. So to do voice cloning, basically you get clips of the person Putin you want to voice quote talking, it'll set up a TTS for you to put your text in and then get your text generated into an mp3 file with There's the cloned voice choice, saying the text. Point. Now what's great about this is that anyone can do this with just 5 bucks and with enough samples and it can just sound really good. However, it can sound a little off or robotic if you use the wrong clips. Or maybe the clips you, you want to use have background noises in them causing the AI voice to sound weird. Using this software, you can make anyone say anything and, and it's just easy to execute. Now let's get on to voice impressions. So voice impressions is when you change your own voice to make it sound like someone else's. Back in the day, I was very fascinated with the concept. What's great about voice impressions is that you could do it for free, no $5, and do practically anyone, and with enough practice, you can make it sound exactly the same. The singing voice of a voice impression voice could be a lot better than AI because the impressionist could control the tones and just make the voice sound just perfect with the song they're trying to sing. However, it could take a lot of time to practice and there isn't a lot of voice impression tutorials out there. So if you want to do a voice impression that doesn't have a voice impression tutorial up, it's up to you to study the character's voice lines and try to replicate it yourself, which is kind of a bummer. So out of the two, which one is better? Well, in my opinion, voice impressioning gets the dub here. For one, the AI voice cloning can't copy the exact mannerisms of a character's voice. For example, maybe a character talks faster when he's excited, or maybe his tone goes lower when he's sad. AI voice cloning can't replicate that unless if it's like manually edited, or at least to my knowledge. Secondly, some characters don't even have enough voice lines to be cloned perfectly, unless if you clone it based off an already made voice impression. But does that mean it sucks? Of course not. Voice cloning is great, okay? And somewhere in the distant future, I guarantee you that voice cloning will just surpass voice impressions by just a long shot. Like a wise man once said. Hey, 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 hey. As a super duper ultra cute UWU furry gamer cat girl, I can't help but want to gush about the amazing power of artificial intelligence, AI. It's gonna like totally change the world and make people question their values. It will also change our economy. But in comparison to gaming, it's Nada, mewing. Gaming is so like rad and super fun. You totally have to check it out. Purring. <laughs>